click the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss any updates from Mission Critical. As we know, summers have been extremely hot here in India and due to global warming, the temperature is rising by around 0.3 to 1.7 degrees Celsius. So to stay cool in this hot summers, I am trying to make a DIY water cooler. So stay tuned and learn how to make one for yourself. Before we jump right into our project, we need to understand what is a TEC. A TEC is a thermoelectric cooler which basically gets hot on one side and gets extremely cold on the other side when applied a potential difference of 12 volts. So we will use this cold side to cool our water and we have to dissipate the heat from the hot side. To dissipate the heat, we will use a heat sink and an exhaust fan. Other than that, we will also require a tap, a container, a thin sheet of metal, a soldering machine, hot glue gun, a blade, gloves for safety, heat compound, and power source like an adapter or a 12 volt battery to power the Peltier modules. To start with our DIY build, we first need to take this plastic container and cut a hole through it and attach a metal conductor that is a thin sheet of metal because we know that plastic is not a good conductor of heat or electricity. So we will cut a hole which is smaller than the size of this metal sheet. Metal sheet should be perfectly fitting the entire Peltier module. Now we will join this metal sheet with this plastic container using the hot glue gun. After we are done with this step, we will now need to create a hole for our tap which will help us to dispense the water from this container. I am using my solder iron to create the hole for this and I will thread my tap into it. After this step, I will apply some heat compound on my heat sink and on the thin sheet of metal so that my Peltier module gets sandwiched between these two surfaces and it is perfectly touching both the surfaces because if it has any space left between them, neither the heat will be dissipated neither it will be uh, useful for cooling the water inside. So make sure there is no gap between the two surfaces. After this installation, now it's time to test our circuit. I'm using a 12 volt power supply that is a 12 volt car battery to power my Peltier module and my exhaust fan along with it. Results were really amazing. I got temperature of around 15 degrees Celsius in the water at a room temperature of around 27 degrees Celsius. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed making your own water cooler. So let me know in the comment section below about what kind of projects would you like to see further and be creative, stay innovative and enjoy the real practical engineering. Bye.